All right, we're going to switch gears here. Right now, more fallout from that officer involved shooting that killed that Missouri, uh, that young man from Missouri near the St. Louis area. Jenna Hancher joins us live in Ferguson with more on what's happening. Jenna? That's right. We're actually in uh, Clayton, in downtown Clayton, where they've gathered outside of the St. Louis County Prosecutor's Office. And that's where protesters are. You can see them behind me. They've been here since about 10 o'clock. One of the things they're very concerned about is the lack of diversity in the police department and at the county level. So they march this morning asking for an end to racism and push for more transparency in the police department. The Ferguson Police Department told the LA Times that there are 50 53 total officers, three of whom are black and two of whom are other minorities. The rest, however, are white. And while blacks make up 65% of the population in Ferguson. How can we ensure that justice is going to take place when we're not a part of the system? And how can you expect us to have confidence in a system that we have no part of? Well, there will continue to be gatherings and protests throughout the day. Reverend Al Sharpton is expected to be here around noon. So we'll continue to bring you updates from Ferguson and the St. Louis area as those become available. Reporting live near St. Louis, Jenna Hanchard, 41 Action News. All right, Jenna, thank you.